Anybody can be a mom, but with the help of a medical team, really anybody, almost anybody can be a parent. So there were a lot of concerns we had about how were they going to function once the baby was born. Um, and as you can see, they have just done amazingly. They can do things that nobody could expect. A miracle child celebrated his first birthday at the Tully Health Center in Stanford on Wednesday. Doctors, nurses, friends and family joined a former Stanford Hospital maternity patient to celebrate the first birthday of her first child. Renu Zelinkis has a condition called severe dystonia, a neurological disorder that has left her unable to walk, speak and live independently. With the help of medical professionals, Renu was able to carry out a high-risk pregnancy into full term without any complications and safely delivered her healthy baby boy Aiden a year ago on July 19th. Every day it's something new, right? We're learning every day. He's learning and it's just amazing. Physicians tell us they were concerned Renu's 80-pound fragile frame would also contribute to a very painful pregnancy. Everybody addressed her medical issues and how could we deal with them. And then once we were able to do that, we made a plan and affected a really great outcome for everybody. And even at a young age, I realized that we place limits on people. They're the limitations that we put on other people, you know? And that was the beautiful thing about my sister, you know? She did not care about what other people thought, um, what she could do or not. Renu left India for the United States after high school and met her future husband, Brian, while studying at Queens College to be a graphic designer. We used to meet in the computer lab and type back and forth and then um, then we started communicating. Physicians say they formed a friendship with Renu by learning to communicate through a computer. After a couple visits, it almost became something that wasn't even there. You kind of looked at her and you waited to hear the computer speak, but you knew that it was coming from her. In Stanford, Priscilla Lombardi, it's relevant.com.